Hello there, very good evening. Welcome to ISTV English News at 7. We will get you to the top developing stories of the state. Here's the news headlines. Former Deputy Chief Minister Gai Kangam asked government not to play politics on security issues to gain political millage. First ever Indo Bangla Manipuri Cultural Festival concludes at the Thai Gaunt, Bangladesh. Let's hear the news in detail. Former Deputy Chief Minister Gai Kangam today asserted it would be good on the part of the government to not to play politics by covering up the truth in state security issues. He was speaking on the sideline of programs of paying tributes to party leaders and inaugurations of three rooms dedicated to three former chief ministers, MPCC library and social media room at Congress Bhavant on BT Road. MPCC President T. N. Haukip, Vice President N. Logan and Emily Govindas Kwantosam were also present on the occasion. Tributes were also paid to former chief ministers M. Kweireng, Risang Kaising and R. K. Joy Chandra. Replying to a question relating to the case of arms missing from 2nd MR Arm Court, Gai Kangam said such case of arms missing was not heard during the tenure of the previous Congress government. It is questionable as to why such case cropped up now in the one-year rules of BJP-led government. Maintaining that there is something fishy in the case, Gai Kangam urged the government not to try and cover up truths behind the case and play politics in such state security issues for political gain. A quirky but tamna secondary report pande. So he am a matunda, Messi, uh, can I talk about secretary? No, I've seen this something questionable. I don't know, Mr. Blame Game Toduna Tanaka Mante. I don't know, I give Mr. Sanna Harabada. A quimatam that Sigumba topic report late, Kangsu Kangde, was it Mohammedan that toy is a machine at all. I don't know, Karika Doge, a Sigumadu later at the Kangan and Habi Via Debra. MPCC President T. N. Haukip said the facilities were inaugurated today to strengthen Congress party under AICC. He also appealed to extend support in the work of Congress and send in suggestions through social and other media. Democracy promote Toba Aduga. A Kuigi principle, Mahatma Gandhi, in a Lincat Piva, non violence movement on secular foundation. Adu strengthen to Nubegi the Makta Twitter account, Loina Hangna by a Kuig Nasi appeal to Zari Adu Galoina Congress Pu Tazaba Marup Mapang Manipur State Labour Makaina. Suggestion, advice from time to time, Piba da ekoi na taram taram na loksin jagani. First Indo Bangla Manipuri Cultural Festival, which began on March 29, has concluded today. The festival was organized with the assistance of Patriotic Writers for a Manipur at Manipur Cultural Complex, the Taigaon, Bangladesh. Secretary of Ministry of Cultural Affairs, Government of Bangladesh, M.D. Nasiruddin Ahmad, Additional Secretary of Ministry of Railway, Sachi Kumar Singh, Secretary of Patriotic Writers for Manipur, Rakesh Naurim, Additional Secretary of BSEC, Government of Bangladesh, Konkham Nilamani, Nilamani and Senior Advocate S.C. Singh attended the closing function of the festival. Additional Secretary Sachi Kumar said it is time to protect the true identities of Manipuri residing in Bangladesh. This unity among Manipuris in Bangladesh has created uncertainty for the community. There are many organizations who are trying to tarnish the image of the true Manipuri diaspora living in Bangladesh. Sachi Kumar, who holds a high position in the government of Bangladesh, further said the festival will help to build a good relationship between the Métis in Manipur and Bangladesh as well as build unity among all Métis residing in different parts of the world. Such kind of festival will show the unity of Bangladesh Manipuri in front of different communities. Around 3,000 Métis, Métis Pangal and other communities from different parts of Bangladesh participated in three-day festival. Director of Nokpade Taudam Ruhini Kumar and Nokpade of Kaisam Kumar, Kwantosam Kundo as well as Dakhya Lambam, Siam Kanhai Wari Liba, S. Chandramani and his teams Pung and Dol Cholom to be presented during the festival. Choreographer of Manipur Cultural Art, Silhat and Sanaton and his teams Classical Dance, Tangta, Maibi Jagoi, 
Kamba Thoibi, Manipuri singer Toktom Lansana and classical dancer Jaya Kundrakpam songs and dances were presented during the festival. Minister of Consumers Affairs, Food and Public Distribution Karam Shyam has asserted that parents have the most important role in molding a child and it would be wrong to hand over such a huge role in the hands of those who are running hostels. Minister was speaking on the sideline of donating ration to the inmates of BP Polt Mental Development Home today. Director of KAF and PD Ranjan Yumnam, Secretary Home Ibo Chaubi and members of Minister's family were present during the handing over of aid to the home. Minister further added that it is wrong to completely place the responsibility of upbringing children on schools and hostels. <laughs> One-day state that bill stakeholders workshop on revision of state action plan on climate change was held at Classic Grande today. The workshop was organized by Directorate of Environment, Director Wide Nabachandra, Anamika Barua from IIT Guwahati, MD of Citran, Dr. Ashok Singh, among others, graced the inaugural functions of the workshop. Speaking on the occasion, Dr. Ashok Singh expressed that rapid urbanization gave huge negative impact on climate and it is therefore needed to enact state action plan for each state according to its prevailing climate condition and factors causing ecological imbalance. Dr. Y. Navachandra said the workshop was held in view of the need to amend state action plan on climate change for the year 2018 to 2023 according to fast changing trend of environment. The workshop aimed at gathering views and opinions of every stakeholders on climate change for necessary amendments. And, uh, all the 22 line departments which were collaborated in the first edition of the SAPCC, again we are going to collaborate with them and uh, in addition certain some of the line departments also will be involved to bring out this SAPCC version 2 that is what in the keynote address mentioned that that that, that is mainly for 2018 to 2013 the NDCs to be reflected is for uh, to, uh, is for the climate change actions that will come after 2020. Member of Parliament Talk to Armenia has condoled the sudden untimely demise of special correspondent of the Telegraph and senior journalist Talk to Kellen. In his condolence message, the H Mania said his demise is a great loss for media fraternity and the void could never be filled. MPTH Mania prayed that his soul to be rested in peace and also shared the grief of the bereaved family. Unable to tolerate nagging pressure from a prescribed time militant organization any longer, singers, musicians, lyricists and music lovers of the state under the banner of Old Manipur Matam Isai Kanglup, Amik, today got together as one and staged incident protests at Hijam Yaitam A large number of popular singers Musical bands, renowned lyricists and music composer took part in the protests. The protesters held placards displaying slogans such as Let the artists serve the people freely. President of Amik S. Tijendra told media person that the most of the artists are daily wage earners. They maintain their families with whatever they earn on a daily basis. The demand for extortion made by the militant group is beyond the capacity of Amik, he said, and appealed to the group to withdraw the demand. Telephoning <laughs> Students of DM College of Arts today staged a sit-in protest at the gate of the college against the failure of the authority to construct fencing around the playground of the college as it was becoming a convenient place for drug users. 
General Secretary of the College Students Union, Arambam Bikesh, said, if the government fails to give a concrete response to the union before April 5, the union may resort to more intense agitations. The principal of the Khabiu Haina Siya Thakre, 11 January, the Adubu Ngasi Fawda, Fazibu Response Laktari, Aduga Miyam Gindomita, Aina Honorable CM, the Unaduna J.P. Sankre, Adubu Examine Taubagi, Hai Adubu Ngasi Fawda, Fazibu Response Amo Pibi Laktari, Aduna Hai Badi, Sigumba, one of the premier colleagues Amo Oribasi, Na Thay Biduna, Thambiri Hai Basi, Gourmet Utpani, Aduna Khoina, April Gay Tang Manga, Si Fawgi Pungbaru, Fawgi Manung Da Gourmet Na, Kaigima Fensing Asi Khabi Baloshan Bagi, Odar Thokpi Daba Targa Di, Akhoi Makhal Makhal Kaya Gi Kung Jan Chang Sanjar Gani. State Vigilance Department has questioned the ex-Chief Minister O. Ibobi in connection with the fund misappropriation case of LDA. A team of State Vigilance led by S.P. Hobson Sapant met the ex-Chief Minister at his official quarter and questioned him. ปัจจุบันนี้ก็ตั้งงานมาเลยมาสิกี้มาตั้งแต่คุยน่ะคอมเมนต์ตัวอ่ะคือแค่นั้นสาวที่มันสิ่งที่เราเป็นเจ้า
On the other hand, members of Imphalis district arrested five persons along with 80 litres of country-made liquor during a drive conducted at Okram to take Chingdamai Khetri Lekai, Uchekon Kuno and Kongba Maka, Nangdevam Lekai. The seized items were destroyed in front of the people. Representatives of Development Protections, United Voluntary Organization, Kajiri Rising Club and Library, Nambol Municipal Council, two councillors and women of the neighbourhoods inspected the cleaning of Nambol River at Kajiri Mamang Lekai areas under Kontosam Assembly Constituency. Secretary of Kajiri Mamang Women's Development Association, H. Kunjalata, said frequent floods Caused due to low river embankments and higher river beds will be solved due to the current river cleaning work being carried out. She also appealed the authority concerned to take up similar works at other places along the river as well. As part of Rashtriya Persikshan Beyond, a one-day boot level workers training program was held at the office of BJP Bishnupur Mandal Ningthau Kong. Vice President of BJP Manipur Pradesh S. H. Premananda Sharma, State Secretary Organization P. Premananda Meite, General Secretary Administration K. Sarat Kumar, President of District Committee R. K. B. Mola and President of the Mandal N. Raghumani attended the training program. Former MLA Kikong Bounume said only after reaching out flagship programs taken up by the government to the people as well as strictly following the fundamental rights of the party by the workers, the stand of the government will be formed and development will be brought in a society. CRPF 32 Battalion upon completion of its 52 years observed Golden Jubilee celebrations at the auditorium of NHPC Loktak Project IGP CRPF Manipur and Nagaland sector Bikram Segald, Managing Director of Manipur Police Housing Corporations Malana Gaut, DIG of CRPF Group Sector Infal Dr. Shubhas Damle, DIG Infal Ranch Brigadier S.K. Sharma, B.C. Bishnupur Pawan Yadav and CEO of the Battalion Raj Gopal Ahmad attended the celebration. Bikram Segal said the CRPF has been taken major role in maintaining law and order in the state. Various projects are taken up for backward sections society to bring equal development under civic action program. Family members of the Jawan should follow the steps of the force to maintain relationship with the people. Many cultural items of different communities were present during the program. Now let's hear the national news. It appears the parliament is heading towards a complete washout. After house proceeding resumed on Monday following a four-day break, opposition members demanding resolutions over two contentious regional issues have forced both houses of parliament to adjourn till tomorrow. Repeated disruptions marred house proceeding in the last four hours, with DDP members agitating for a special category status for Andhra Pradesh and AIADMK members raising the covarium water dispute. As many as four no-confidence motions are pending before the chair, but they weren't taken up due to the under-relenting protests inside both houses. The Congress, DDP, YSR, Congress and CPIM have filed notice for a no-confidence motion against the NDA government and regional parties like the TRS, DMK, DMC and others have extended their support to the mo motions. AIADMK said it would not hesitate to file a no-confidence motion over the Covery dispute and demanded the Congress to back it. A no-confidence motion will only be allowed in the event of 50 or more parliament members are signatories. Once again, let's hear the head news headlines. Former Deputy Chief Minister Guy Kangam asked government not to play politics on security issues to gain political mileage. First ever Indo Bangla Manipuri Cultural Festival concludes at Tetai Gaon, Bangladesh. That's all we got with ICB English News Bulletin. Thank you for joining us.